Hello friends, today I am going to give you information on jaundice that happens to the newborn baby. Today I am going to tell you the reason why babies, newborn babies often get this disease just after the birth. How much common this jaundice is and what is the treatment for this type of jaundice. And how are you going to recognize that your baby is suffering from this jaundice disease. Also we will discuss when this jaundice becomes a critical situation. So all this information I am going to give you in this video. So let's start it. First of all, I want to tell all the parents to not to get terrified when you hear that your baby, newborn baby has got this jaundice because this is very much different from the jaundice that happens in the you know elder people. So let's discuss about the newborn babies. So newborn babies basically get this disease jaundice when the level of bilirubin increases in their blood. Bilirubin is a kind of salt basically and it is it forms basically when the RBC that is the red blood cells breaks down in the blood. So type and the level of bilirubin defines how much jaundice uh, the baby has whether it is under the control limit or it is out of the control but uh, more or less it is always in the control and uh, the treatment is easily available. So when your newborn baby suffers from this jaundice disease it is easily can be seen from the uh, from the yellowish of the skin and then it goes down to the bottom onto the legs of the baby. So you can easily see and identify also this disease. But don't worry, it is not dangerous in the newborn baby. It can easily be treated. The criticality of the jaundice is identified by the time when the jaundice appear on baby. I mean, uh, if it appears within the 24 hours of the baby's birth, then it is a critical and it need an immediate treatment. So if the newborn baby is suffered from this disease within the 24 hours of the birth, so doctor will take special care of it, special treatment, and they will take the custody of the baby and they will you know give some sort of treatment to them but don't worry it is very much normal almost 65 percent of babies get this type of jaundice after the birth some babies get this disease of jaundice after two to three days of the birth so that is treated almost like normal it is a bit not that much critical like the jaundice that happens to the baby within the 24 hours so it can be also treated very easily so if the baby gets this jaundice disease after two to three days of the birth so almost it takes almost a week to get away automatically or by showing the sun sign or by breastfeeding the baby however in the babies who are born prematurely the jaundice appears after five or six days and the baby takes almost a month to get rid of this disease jaundice during pregnancy, the ladies who are suffering with the gestational diabetes are more prone or their babies are more prone to get this disease, jaundice. Also in some of the studies, it is said that uh, the boy is more prone to uh, jaundice uh, in respect to the girl, newborn baby. The pregnant lady who have the blood group of O type are more prone, I mean the baby is more prone to get the jaundice. Another reason of uh, baby getting the jaundice is if the blood group of mother and the baby differs. So this is the reason why bilirubin increases in the blood and uh, how it is uh, dangerous at times for the baby because it uh, can harm the baby's brain as well. So let's see what all are the treatment available for the jaundice and how you can also treat your baby at home for the disease jaundice. Uh, but before going forward, let me remind you that if you are visiting my channel first time, please do subscribe to my channel. Please hit the bell icon so whensoever I am up with a new video, you can easily get the notification of it. Also, I want to tell you, if you want to hear this video in Hindi language, the link is given in the description. You can go to that link and you can hear this video in Hindi language as well. Okay friends, so let's continue the video. So when the doctor finds the symptoms of the disease in the baby, first thing they go for is to have the blood test to confirm this disease. This test basically gives the exact measure or the level of the bilirubin. In case of a healthy baby who is not prematurely delivered, doctor waits uh, till the bilirubin level is above 16. So if it's below 16, then there is another process. If it's above 16, then the doctor takes in an another step. If the level of bilirubin in a healthy baby is above 16, then uh, doctor give phototherapy to the baby. It's a therapy in which baby is kept in fluorescent light. Due to the effect of this phototherapy, uh, with this uh, light, the bilirubin breaks down. While giving the phototherapy, the baby's clothes are put off and it is in the direct uh, light of that phototherapy. It takes almost two days of in the phototherapy to break down the bilirubin and bring it down to a not that much critical level. To protect the baby's eyes, uh, baby's eyes is generally wrapped with uh, some sort of cover. So in this way, doctor gives the phototherapy to treat the jaundice disease in babies. Also, you can treat jaundice at home if the level of bilirubin is below the critical mark of 16 in the healthy baby. For treating the baby at home, you need to show sunlight to the baby. Uh, it is advisable that you show the sunlight in the morning time 
or in the evening time when so ever the sun is coming up or going down in the sunlight of the very early morning or uh, in the evening uh, baby should be kept for near about 20 minutes this way also the level of bilirubin will come down and kindly be aware that uh, don't pull, uh, don't prolong this uh, treatment of the sunshine it is only advisable till 20 minutes as it can cause sunburn to the soft skin of the baby okay friends so now let's see what are the symptoms you can easily see and diagnose that your baby is suffering from jaundice at home it's a very common disease in newborn baby so when after the delivery you come back home you can follow some very simple steps to diagnose your baby is suffering from jaundice or not keep your baby in a room where there is ample light and uh, press the chest of your baby and when you will release if you will see a yellowishness on the skin that means that baby is suffering from jaundice also you must see the eyes of the baby the white uh, area of the eyes if it is turning palish yellowish then it also reveals that the baby is suffering from jaundice the skin that is around the eyes will also be turning yellowish this paleness also get into the nails and the other skin uh, also it is sometimes visible on the mouth area so these are the few symptoms you can easily diagnose at home that your baby is suffering from jaundice or not also you need to see the color of the urine of the baby if it is turning excessive yellowish maybe the baby is suffering with jaundice or baby is not taking the ample sleep that is also a sign that baby may be suffering from jaundice or if the baby is not uh, taking the breast milk properly then it is uh, a chance that the baby is suffering from jaundice so apart from prototherapy that is done at the hospital, the best treatment at home would be to breastfeed your baby. Try to breastfeed your baby as much as you can because breastfeeding is the best treatment in case of jaundice. The more the baby will take your milk inside, the more it will urinate and do toilets. So the more your baby will breastfeed, the more toilet it will do. In this way also the jaundice will come out of the baby because the toilet will be the only way for the broken bilirubin to come out of the body of the baby. So I will advise you to breastfeed your baby as much as you can. If, so if the baby is not taking the breast milk properly, you can also feed the baby formula milk. So the main thing is to uh, urinate. So the main thing is that the baby is doing toilet because this is the only way the bilirubin will be coming out of the body. So friends, this was all about the information to be given on jaundice that usually happens in babies, newborn babies. So hope you have liked the video. If you like the video, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel and share this video amongst your friend who need this type of video thanks for watching